The video you're looking at is a lot more than just some pretty medical imaging. Rather, as we zoom in, you're going to see that this is proof that scientists have been able to create organoids that grow their own blood vessels. This is a huge breakthrough. In case you didn't know, an organoid is basically a lab-grown organ or piece of tissue, and one of the major limitations to them is that since they're lab-grown, they don't develop natural blood vessels. So blood flow in these is very restricted, and thus their size and usefulness is also very restricted. So back over to the article, more specifically what we're looking at is a liver organoid, and they were able to generate organ-specific blood cells for the first time ever. So the organoid is just something that's grown in a lab, in a petri dish, a piece of liver tissue, brain tissue, uh, typically grown from stem cells. But typically they would only grow to a certain size before they would be starved for blood. The neat part of this study isn't growing the organ, it's rather that scientists were able to use an inverted multi-layer air-liquid interface, or IMALI culture system, to support, and this right here is essentially the growing of blood vessels, that as the cells began to organize around the organ organoid, it began to naturally vascularize due to the changes that were been made. And some of the key findings from this research are that we now have development of fully functional human blood vessels in organoids, or blood vessels that are functional inside of lab-grown organs. They have sinusoid-like features, which is very impressive. This can lead to treatments or corrections of a variety of coagulation type disorders and a whole bunch of different liver disorders like a liver that would die of alcohol failure, liver poisoning or something like that could much more easily be replaced now. And it even has applications beyond just liver organoids. The scientists believe that this culture method will allow for multiple cell types to self-organize naturally, which means they suspect that they can grow blood vessels in other types of tissues, like they could grow a heart with a blood vessel or a brain with blood vessels and things like that in it. It's baby, it's tiny, but it is a stepping stone towards something very big.